Hi, uh, welcome to another uh, video tutorial. In this video tutorial, I'm going to kind of go through how to add a uh, audio link to your WordPress without paying for it. Um, it. Usually, if you try and upload and embed an audio link in your WordPress, just adding an MP3 file to it, WordPress will say, do you want to buy our upgrade? And of course, you're like, well, I don't really want to buy it, but if, if that's what I have to do. Um, so I'm going to show you how not to do that. So in this tutorial, in order to get through WordPress's sort of paywall for audio links, you're going to have to have another place to, to load your file. It's kind of like having a offshore bank account to keep your money in so that the government auditors don't see what you're doing with your money. So basically what you're doing is you're putting the file into Dropbox.com, you're telling WordPress, hey, this file's in Dropbox.com, and if you want to look at it, this is how you find it. Um, and then WordPress with a certain command, it's bracket audio space uh, public link and bracket. Uh, we'll then reference that file and bring it up and make a nice little nifty WordPress player so it looks all nifty and professional on your blog. So without further ado, I'm going to show you how to do that. The very first thing you need to do if you're going to embed um, an MP3 file into your WordPress is to make a public folder in your Dropbox account. So basically you have to put this web address in. Uh, HTTPS dot dot slash slash www.dropbox.com backslash help backslash 16 backslash en e as in Eric, n as in Nancy. So enter all that information into your um, navigation bar, hit return, and you'll go to the screen that talks about how they remove public folders on October 4th, 2012. Once you're here, it's pretty simple. All you have to do is go down into it says creating a public folder and then just click on the bit right here that says click here to enable one on your account. And so click there and make a public folder and then you can follow the rest of the instructions. Log. Now, the tough thing about this is that the file has to be an MP3 file so when you exported it from GarageBand or wherever you got it you need to make sure it exports as an MP3 not an MP4 AAC or some other uh, weirdo audio file format and the other thing that you're going to need to make sure you do is upload it to a nice third space like Dropbox um, the good thing about this tutorial is that it gets around WordPress's paywall that it puts up if you try and up load and uh, embed an mp3 from the WordPress archive. So we're putting it somewhere else so that WordPress won't charge you to read it. Alright, so that said, uh, Dropbox is a great place to do this. So to do that, you go to the Dropbox site, click on the sign in button, uh, put in your email or sign up for an account. I've already signed up for one. Uh, I think that's my password. Sign in. It's going to send me to my Dropbox homepage. Now the key to here on Dropbox is that you need to use the uh, public folder when you upload your file. So click on public. And then there's this little arrow thing right here. It says upload. So you grab that, upload. And it says I can drag and drop files or I can choose them. So why don't I just drag this, this mp3 demo file into the page. Drop your file to upload to public. OK. That's easy enough. So now it says down here that's uploading and it has a little status bar. Um, so that's a good start for uploading my file to Dropbox, my MP3. Then go into WordPress while it uploads. Um, I can click on this and I will go to the best blog ever. And I'll jump straight to new post because that's what I'm going to want to do. Um, and then listen to my podcast exclamation point alright so once I've got this new post up um, I can go back to my public folder in Dropbox and you see it says uploaded demo view details if I right click on the podcast demo I get this option to copy public link and that's exactly what I'm going to need for my WordPress so I'll copy the public link and copy to clipboard. So now I have the cop public link of this Dropbox file in my clipboard. So if I hit paste, it will come up. Come back to the blog, and I'm going to paste it into my blog. 
Now the key is that I put it in a command string. So the command string looks like this uh, under the text editor, which helps you HTML. Our command string looks like uh, bracket audio xxxxx, where xxxxx is the file name, and this is the file we want to move there. So I'm going to take this, cut it from there, and put it straight into this bracket, paste. And having done that, with a space, if I extend the window a little, you'll see that it all fits. Um, I can publish. And now I've published four posts, and once the Wheel of Doom stops spinning, I can give a look at this. I click on the blog. Uh, there's my awesome banner, and now listen to my podcast. And I have this little nice WordPress widget right here that lets me listen to the podcast. So if I hit play, well, my now if I hit play. And that's a really nice way to make a professional looking and sounding uh, podcast link in your blog. Uh, well, thanks for watching this video. I hope this helps. I hope you're able to now upload uh, audio files to your blog with ease and finesse. Thanks for watching, and I hope you have a great day.